What is up guys, it's James here and today I'm on OP Skins looking at their brand new feature. Yeah, this is pretty insane. They have finally added random skins to OP Skins, but they have implemented it in a way which is a lot different to other sites like CSGO Shop and Kingwin. They just had inventories of items which you then buy and then you know you get the random skin from it. This is very different. This uses uh, the users listings on OP skins, all of their items that are on their bots are up for grabs with this, right? So you pay the amount for the mystery skin, they pay the person who's put it up there and they give it to you. And they've done it by category. So random pistols, rifles, SMGs, heavy knives, you can do random for each one of those categories, right? So to get to them, you just click on whatever you want the pistols. It doesn't matter which pistol you click, you will always be greeted by the mystery pistol here. So if you click rifles, doesn't matter which one you click, you'll always be greeted by the mystery rifle there. So how does it work? Well, you pay, in this case, 9.95 for the mystery rifle. And um, the prices change constantly depending on the prices of the knife or rifles that are available. And it will say here what the prices range from. <laughs> um, so you could get a two cent skin for $10 or you get a $1,440 uh, Stat Track Factory New Fire Serpent, right? For $10. Um, obviously, they're going to be making money, so the average person is going to be losing out in theory, but it's, it's a gamble, right? They're going to make it so the expected value is in their favor, but there is a good chance that you will get something expensive, right? <laughs> but there's also a good chance that you'll get something very cheap. That's how they balance it out. I am going to do the most high risk one out of all of them. I'm going to do a random knife, which at the moment is sitting at $114.95 and I could get a knife worth $38 for that, or I could get a knife worth $2,300. Uh, after I buy it, it will be delivered to my inventory um, on OP skins and then I can pull it out or sell it straight from there if I want to. Yeah, this money isn't to buy a skin for me, so I'm hoping that it's something good so I can sell it on and take the money out because this is sort of an investment to make a video. But yeah, let's uh, let's give it a shot. $115. Please don't get a $38 knife. Do it. Finding my mystery knife. <sighs> oh... $55. Spent $115 to get a $55 <laughs> Falchion Scorched. Minimal wear. Brilliant. So, I was one of the unlucky ones. Oh, that's bad. That's half the value. Oof. Ah, okay, now moving on to the next category. Gosh, that was terrible. Um, mystery Rifle. Let's see what my luck is. Ten dollars. This is going to cost me. Let's do it. <laughs> GS Orange Crash. Eight cents. Let's do another one of those. <sighs> okay. Come on. Something good, please. Three cents, right? Not doing any more of these. I'm I'm done. I'm done. Thanks, OP skins. Just spent $130 and got $50 back. Well, so yeah, they implemented it in an interesting way, but it looks like the expected value is not just a little bit in their favor, but massively in their favor. <laughs> hmm. Am I going to recommend this? Not necessarily. Um, somebody in my comments said that they did it yesterday and they spent $10 on the rifle and they got something worth 3 cents as well. It appears that it's not very good. Let's give a pistol a go. $2.25, uh, 2 cents to $494. Do it. 55 cents, yeah. It looks like they've definitely... Um, yeah, they've definitely put the expected value as, as 
oh, something quite low. I would say probably set about 60%. Alright, so yeah. I hope you enjoyed the video, guys. I hope you enjoyed seeing me waste my money. Um, if you liked the video, leave it a like. If you want to see more content like this, reviewing various sites with random skins, stuff like that, top five knives. Be sure to subscribe if you fancy supporting me. Uh, check out my Patreon below. And yeah, I shall see you guys next time.